Welcome to the book reading program of 3ABN Australia Radio. Does your faith need a boost? Do you think that miracles only happened in Bible times? Think again. Compiled by Remnant Publications, the book Get Ready for a Miracle recounts true stories that prove that when we step out in faith, God displays His power in undeniable ways. Here is our reader, Sandra Ashton. This story is entitled, God Fixes Satellite Equipment. Proverbs 21 verse 1 says, The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord, like the rivers of water. He turns it wherever he wishes. In 1994, John Dinsey, who today is General Manager of 3ABN Latino, arrived in Chicago after finding Christ while he was in the military stationed in Germany. He had been told that an excellent job was going to be coming his way. He waited a couple of days, but the company never called. He didn't know his phone was out of order. The company had been trying to reach him, but couldn't get through. During this waiting time, John became impressed about the miracles he was hearing as he watched 3ABN. Wouldn't it be wonderful to work at such a place, he thought. The first week that John was working at 3ABN, he volunteered to answer the phone during the live broadcast when he received a praise report about a stuck dish. One day, my satellite dish was stuck on 3ABN. I had never seen this station before, but since it was the only channel coming in, I continued watching it for two or three months. I loved it because the messages were from the Bible. I was still going to church on Sunday, but was just about ready to make a change when my dish stopped working. I was greatly disappointed and got on my knees. Lord, I prayed, if Saturday is still the Sabbath and you want me to keep it, fix my satellite equipment. I got up, turned the TV on, and it was working. I'm a leader in my church. I'm going there next Sunday and telling everyone what I've learned on 3ABN. Another time when John was working master control, he received a call from a Spanish-speaking woman asking what was happening to her satellite equipment. She and her husband had been switching channels and found 3ABN. They started watching. Somehow, the dish got stuck on 3ABN. Since her husband wanted to watch soccer and other international programs, they had the dish repaired. But the repairman didn't program 3ABN back into their system. Several weeks went by. They were beginning to miss 3ABN, but didn't know how to find it. Then one day, they were watching a soccer match. Outside, it was raining with lightning and thunder. The lights in the room flickered. And suddenly, they weren't watching soccer. They were watching 3ABN. She and her husband got down on their knees and prayed, Thank you, Lord, for bringing 3ABN back to us. And thank you for letting us know we should be watching it. They called back a number of times to give progress reports. The last time they called, they reported they were going to Mexico to tell their parents what they had learned on 3ABN. A reflection associated with this story comes from The Desire of Ages, page 258. The means by which we can overcome the wicked one is that by which Christ overcame, the power of his word. God does not control our minds without our consent, but if we desire to know and to do His will, His promises are ours. Ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. If any man willeth to do His will, he shall know of the teaching. John chapter 8, verse 32, chapter 7, verse 17, Revised Version. Through faith in these promises, Every man may be delivered from the snares of error and the control of sin. 
God Fixes Satellite Equipment was submitted by Three Angels Broadcasting Network, the Mending Broken People Network, a 24-hour Christian television and radio network. You can visit 3abn.org for more information. You've been listening to the book reading program by 3ABN Australia Radio, featuring Get Ready for a Miracle. For more information about this book, visit remnantpublications.com. Thank you.